Alabaster, Alabama is a growing city that's experiencing great success. Getting its start in the late 1890s in the community of Siluria, Thomas C. Thompson opened the Buck Creek Cotton Mill. Then in 1927, George L. Scott Sr. opened the Alabaster Lime Plant because of a large concentration of calcium limestone in the area. This rock is also known as Alabaster. In 1953, the city of Alabaster incorporated with 600 residents. Today, it has more than 31,000 residents and offers vast retail shopping, medical services, and light industrial trade. Alabaster is located in Shelby County along I-65 and Highway 31, just 30 minutes south of downtown Birmingham. With Shelby Baptist Medical Center and its surrounding physician services, the stretch of US-31 that runs through Alabaster has been branded the Medical Mile. To continue the City of Alabaster's purposeful and directed growth, they partnered with the Regional Planning Commission of Greater Birmingham to update their comprehensive plan. This updated plan has been branded as Alabaster Forward. During the planning process, two priority redevelopment areas were identified, Soluria Mill and the Medical Mile. Separate videos provide more detailed information. In this video, you will see an overview of the comprehensive plan along with some of the key recommendations the city should undertake as it relates to business, family, and quality of life. Alabaster is at a crossroads. The choices it makes in land development, transportation, and parks will have a profound influence for decades to come. The city of Alabaster is a vibrant, growing, and dynamic community. It was an intentional effort on the part of city leadership to create this comprehensive plan. We are proud of our city. We want to be Shelby County's premier city, and we're striving to have a higher quality of life for our residents and a brighter future. We started the Alabaster Forward planning process by meeting with the residents, business owners, and city leaders to learn what are the issues and what is their vision for the future. From the input that we received at the community meetings, our team crafted six main goals for the comprehensive plan. First, create a greater sense of community. Second, encourage a more tech-savvy business environment. Third, improve land use and encourage quality urban design. Fourth, promote a healthy and safe living environment. Fifth, Provide a range of transportation options, such as walking, bicycling, transit, and driving. Sixth, provide quality government services through partnership and cooperation. So we considered what can be done to boost Alabaster's economy, to increase its sales tax base, and to attract more jobs. The Regional Planning Commission recommends that future growth be directed into mixed-use centers. A mixed-use center allows for a walkable mix of retail, offices, restaurants, and housing. Next, to create a more uniform and aesthetically pleasing appearance, we recommend that the city adopt stricter design regulations along State Route 119 and the US 31 Medical Mile. With the concentration of healthcare services along the Medical Mile and shopping centers throughout Alabaster, we recommend the city provide a local shuttle for residents, especially seniors, to easily access the Senior Center, Shelby Baptist Medical Center, and the Promenade. As the city invests in fiber optic lines, citizens are asking for the city to attract more tech-savvy businesses. We recommend Alabaster evaluate the feasibility of a local business incubator program. We also made recommendations on how we can enhance the quality of life for residents in the areas that they live, shop, and play. Residents want to see new cultural amenities, additional restaurant options, and entertainment venues. What if the Medical Mile became a destination hotspot that attracts people after 5 p.m.? To create that, we recommend that a new Civic Center, as part of an entertainment venue, be constructed near the intersection of US 31 and Industrial Road. Residents want to see more sidewalks and trails. Therefore, we recommend that the Buck Creek Trail be extended north to connect the US 31 Medical Mile and south to Veterans Park. Outdoor gathering spaces are vital to a community. We recommend that Siluria Mill be redeveloped into a civic and cultural center with a town green, amphitheater, and mixed-use buildings front in 11th Avenue. The Regional Planning Commission of Greater Birmingham is excited to provide the City of Alabaster with a roadmap to make more informed decisions. With quality urban design and careful planning, Alabaster will continue as a premier place to live, work, shop, and play. Alabaster Forward is the city's comprehensive plan that's going to guide us over the next 10 to 15 years. And we are excited about the work that's gone into it, the input that we've received, and we feel like it's a very good product. 
The comprehensive plan contains over 90 action items for us to consider implementing internally. This video contains a sampling of the key recommendations in the full document. We encourage you to go to the city's website and download the entire document as well as other videos and supporting documents. To view the other videos and download the Alabaster Forward Comprehensive Plan, go to cityofalabaster.com.